All right, we're gonna try another swirl here today. I've been using these one-shot paints in my testing, and I've had some really good results when I test. I've put them in these Kafka bottles, and it makes pouring over the water a lot easier. So I'm gonna do two basic colors here today, a black and a lime green. Got my water full of borax here. It's at 72 degrees. I got myself a digital thermometer so I know that it's at the right temperature. As I've been testing, it seems like the right temperature is between 70 and 80. And I've got my Zinzer stained black water based primer, and I'll be using that. This is a white pine. Telly body, and we'll do this swirl today. Start with the black. I had to thin this just slightly in my test, it was sitting. And what I've learned is as you're watching the paint, you're looking for it to expand across all the different spots, then you kind of know it's ready to swirl. Do some lime green. Let's see, see the paint dispersing pretty well. Go back with some more black. So here, since it's already sitting on top of other paint, you can let it sit for a little bit longer to disperse. We got a stick, start to swirl this around. Some of it's skinning over. So some of this is skinned over a little bit, but we'll we'll try and dip it here anyway. Some of the spots that it's skinned over here, I've just kind of taken my finger and kind of rubbed it out, any of the high spots. This body actually came out really nice. Nice swirl, probably the swirl's not as great as I wanted it, but since the green was skinning over, I, I wanted to at least try and dip it. 
overall, pretty happy with it. What I like about one shot is that it sits nice on the water and that I haven't had a whole lot of skinning issues. You know, this time I did, I don't really know why. Um, but really, not a whole lot of runs or anything like that, like some of the stuff I've gotten with the testers. There's really no bubbling. Uh, I've had some bubbling with the testers. Oh, I'm really happy with this. Looks pretty cool. So here we are about 12 hours later. This actually ended up drying really nice. There's really no bubbles in it. And the places that had some of the skin, I just kind of wiped away. Overall, I really like using these one-shot paints. The gloss sits really nice on the wood. It's smooth, you know, you had to thin the black out just a little bit. Uh, but really happy with these paints. Definitely be using them moving forward. And it's got kind of a nice coat on it, so if you really want to be, you know, simple, you could just leave it. Probably recommend putting a hard coat on it, but overall really happy with this one-shot paint. Cool how it turned out with kind of the black background. It really made the green pop, and then where the black kind of ran out a little bit, it kept it dark. So, neat swirl. Not a perfect swirl, uh, but getting a lot better.